Hi there, I'm Will of the People. Would you like to know the most powerful way to overcome tyrants at the federal, state, and local level? You know, the people like politicians and judges and Wall Street bankers and their corporate cronies who are shoving laws down your throat or not enforcing laws that should be enforced? Well, I'm going to share with you and reveal to you the most powerful way you can be powerful with your friends and loved ones to overcome the tyrants who are exploiting you and your friends and loved ones and fellow Americans. Now first you need to understand a dirty little secret that the big fat cats and rich boys know that we, the rest of us don't like to admit to ourselves and that's this that you can petition and protest and even replace politicians but as long as you are prevented from participating in real governing by the consent of the governed and in participating in what laws we will live by they know that they can always bribe the politicians that you abdicate and surrender your power to that you hope will not betray you but who will ultimately betray you because the fat cats can always buy them off. Now the reason every nation in history has gone through cycles of rising and falling and ultimately collapsing is because this has been the way every system of governing has been designed where the fat cat banker types and corporate types could always bribe the politicians and exploit the people now the way to stop this kind of tyranny and stop the fat cats dead in their tracks is to stop abdicating and surrendering your power to politicians and judges who betray you, me, and we the people for the very small number of people who are exploiting the rest of us. Now the way to do this is really framed in this simple context. Which do you prefer? Surrendering your power to politicians and then being limited to petitioning and protesting or replacing the politicians you've come to realize are betraying you with new politicians who the fat cats then bribe and get to betray you again or voting on the issues yourself and we the people being able to truly exercise our right to consent to what laws we live by. That's the way we the people participate in power. And when we're participating in power, that's when we are happy. But it's when we are disenfranchised from participating in power that we are subjected to tyranny and misery. And the root of the word misery is miser. And that's what the predators who are exploiting us economically are. They're misers. They don't want to share. Get it? Now, here's how you can be powerful. Go to the website righttoconsent.com and there you will find the blueprint for how we the people can literally create a system that is truly governing by the consent of the governed. And I want to make a point here. We've all been brainwashed to believe that the United States of America is a nation with a system of governing by the consent of the governed. But what most people don't realize is there is no provision in the United States Constitution which creates the framework, it's the contract for the system of our system of governing. There's no provision in there for we the people to exercise our right to consent to any proposed law or any laws enacted and enforced against us. So 
what we have to do is stop drinking the Kool-Aid, all of us, and learn, change how we think, and learn how we can change the system to one where we the people are exercising our right to consent to any proposed law or any law enacted and enforced against us. I'm not a politician, and I never want to be, but I do want to see our nation, the United States of America, and I'd like to see every nation in the world understand that freedom is only secured by our right to consent to the powers of government, which are the laws that are enacted and enforced against us. And the only way we're going to have that is when we the people change how we think and unite to literally create a real democracy and stop the tyranny of the corporate criminals, banker criminals, and their political and judicial cronies who are enabling them to exploit us. I'm will of the people and I approve this message and I know if you master the plan and how to galvanize the people so that we the people are exercising our right to consent. You will approve of this message too. Thanks for watching.